Hi fitness team, I'm Bethann Wittig and I'm the fitness and personal training coordinator here at Rutgers Recreation. Today I'm going to be taking you through a stretching routine that you can do at your desk. When we're sitting at our desks, whether you're studying or at work, we are sitting for a very long time in this hunched over position, right? So we really want to try to alleviate that tension and in improve our posture by sitting up nice and tall and going through the stretching routine. As I go through this routine, if you feel good and you want to go through it a little bit longer, feel free to pause the video and hold that stretch and then come back to it. So we're going to get started with facing your desk or um, if you don't have a desk you can put your hands on your thighs but we're going to put our hands onto the desk and go through a cat cow uh, sequence so just like you would do on all fours i want you to tuck your chin and round your back bringing your chin all the way to your chest rounding your back feeling this stretch in your upper back Inhale in and on your next exhale, look up all the way up to the ceiling and arch your back. Holding it there, inhale in and exhale out. One more time, tucking that chin again, rounding your back. And on your next exhale, all the way up, looking up to the ceiling and arching that back. Good, coming back to neutral, you're gonna stay in a nice um, arched position. So you're gonna bring both arms all the way up overhead and we're just gonna reach back just to your range of motion, feeling that nice stretch in your low back and then come back to neutral. And doing that again, just holding for about three seconds to the back and all the way back to neutral. Inhale in, reach back and exhale back to neutral we're going to go through this one more time and exhale out good bringing your hands down we're going to go to your neck so we hold a lot of tension in our neck like i said in this hunched over position right whether you're on your phone or on your laptop so first just a simple neck roll you're going to bring your head all the way around nice and slow to the back around to the other side and when your head gets back to the front, reverse positions or rotation. Good, and go through this one more time each side. Good. Maybe you hold a little bit longer if it feels good in one position. When you come back to the front, come back up to neutral and we're gonna focus on that neck a little bit more. What I want you to do is anchor your right hand underneath your chair and just allow your left hand to um, relax down. Then you're just going to bring your left ear to your left shoulder. So anchoring your head is just allowing a little bit more of a stretch through your scalenes, which is those small muscles in your neck. And again, just going to your range of motion. Take a nice big inhale in. And on the exhale, go a little bit deeper into that stretch. So pushing that left hand down to the ground. Good. Inhale in. And on your next exhale, I want you to just turn your head and look down towards your armpit. So now you're going to feel a little bit more stretch in your trap, which you normally do hold that, a lot of tension and stress throughout the day. Again, when you inhale, next exhale, just go a little bit deeper into that stretch. Don't crank it, but just till it feels good. And come back up to neutral. And we're just going to do that with the other side. So anchor your left hand. Nice, good posture. Putting your right hand down. And then right ear to right shoulder. Good, big inhale in, exhale a little bit deeper into that stretch. And same thing, turning, rotating down, looking down at your armpit and feeling that trap stretch. So right now, focusing on that neck. Inhale in and 
exhale a little bit deeper into the stretch. And come back up to neutral. We're going to move now to our shoulders and chest. So big shoulder roll, just five here. Bring your shoulders up, around, and down. Good. Nice, good breathing. Open up your diaphragm, allowing good posture. One more time. And exhale out. Now we're going to open our chest, so bring your palms and your elbows together and opening up your chest just until you feel that stretch, stretching through your chest and your pecs, and come back. It doesn't have to be fast, just a nice fluid motion. So as we're seated in that hunched position, our chest muscles get very tight, so we want to stretch them as much as possible. And we actually want to strengthen our back as much as possible to work on that posture. Good. Two more here. All right. Pushing your hands forward, stretching a little bit through our wrists. So just a few wrist rolls. One visit, one way around, and then alternate that rotation. And we're going to stretch through our forearms. So let's start with our fingers facing down. If this is enough stretch, that's fine. Or you can kind of put your other hand on top of your other wrist and hold it there for about 10 seconds. If you want more of a stretch, you can curl into your fingers. Good, and then switch sides. Same thing. This is good if you're typing a lot on your computer. All right, and then just opposite, we're gonna go palms up and fingers up pulling towards you. And other side. All right, a little bit into our lower body for our last stretches. I want you to place your, cross your one foot over your other leg, just above your knee, so that you're not putting uh, stress on your knee, and then just push down and lean forward. So this is going to stretch into your piriformis and that side glute. You can flex your foot if that feels comfortable. Your leg may be up here, that's okay, it's all just um, your flexibility and your range of motion, but this should feel pretty good if we've been sitting for a while. Again, doing a few deep breaths, and on the exhale, maybe going a little bit deeper. If you have a lot of flexibility, you can kind of go onto your elbows and push down. Slowly coming out of that, you're gonna to go to the other side. Same thing. Push down, and feeling that stretch there. All right, and our last stretch is just gonna be a little of that low back. So you're just gonna do a little torso rotation. Maybe you're holding on to whatever, you know, the back of your uh, chair, placing your opposite hand on the outside of your knee and turning to feel that rotation. Keeping your chest up nice and proud. And then other side. And that concludes our stretches at your desk. Thank you for joining me today. Bill, um, we welcome you to look at all of our on-demand videos on our website and join our fitness and wellness classes.